flushing your coolant system, all right? The new stuff they say is 100,000 mile antifreeze. I don't care, any good mechanic will tell you it still needs to be flushed out. Get the old stuff out, get new stuff in. It's gonna prolong your coolant system. First thing you're gonna do, with the motor cooled down, you're gonna take the radiator cap off. You never take the radiator cap with the motor hot. So you're gonna see how thick and yucky this stuff is. This should be green antifreeze, not this whatever that is. So now we've got the vehicle up there. We're find, we found the drain plug on the radiator. It's just a plastic plug. Every once in a while there'll be a metal one, but most of them are plastic. Just turn it to the left. As you do anything else, lefty loosey, righty tidy. Unfortunately for most people and for us too, this coolant's gonna flow everywhere. Have you a drip pan underneath to try to collect all you can. This is a hazardous waste, so it needs to be disposed of properly. And once it's done draining, close your drain plug and lower the vehicle down. Make sure your drain plug is tight. Check the manual for the proper coolant for your vehicle and fill your radiator back up with coolant. After you installed your radiator cap and your coolant is foot full, make sure that you double check your coolant reservoir bottle. About half full is what it says. There's actually a mark on it that says full when hot, full when cold. Make sure that level's good and you've now flushed your coolant system.